No. Newtons. Third law of motion. Okay. It's a crisp law. It states that to every action. There is equal and opposite of the pattern. Opposite Suppose that we have let us say an object A. and object B. One is moving towards A and one B is moving towards A and A is moving towards B. They collide. They collide. Then this A, let us suppose this collision remains for small time with our DT. This A will exert force automatically okay, on A that is a, a, this A will exert force, force on B due to A. In turn, B will also exert force. It is obvious. F, force acting on A due to B. Okay? left Okay? Yes, sir. So, force acting on Now, you see that one is acting on let us say positive direction of x axis and another is acting on negative direction of x axis. So, this statement can be put in mathematical form as force acting on A due to B is negative times force acting on B due to A, or you can write FBA equal to minus A, uh, this uh, FAB. Okay? You can take this negative or this negative, clear? So, this is Newton's third law. Now, what are the points to remember about it? Number one. So, these points have to be remembered. Number one. A single isolated force does not exist. So there are always two forces. One which acts on whenever, suppose that I push this uh, table. Now when I have pushed this table, now one force and the return, the table gives the another force. So singly force never exists. Suppose you fire a gun, you fire a bullet, so, blade pair jab force lagta hai, there is an equal force on the gun. So, both exist simultaneously. Correct? Number two. Forces in nature always in pairs. Forces always exist in pairs. So obviously, just a single, a single isolated force does not exist. A force always exists. This is one and same thing. Dusra, tisra. Newton's third law. Law. Is applicable. For all types of forces in nature, that means it is obeyed by third law is obeyed by both uh, all forces, whether mechanical, gravitational, electrostatic, electromagnetic, 
हर एक में न्यूट्रॉन थर्ड ला वैलिड है ग्रेविटेशनल फोर्स भी में भी या नॉर्मल जो हम मैकेनिकल फोर्सेस लगाते हैं उनमें भी इलेक्ट्रोस्टैटिक फोर्स यानी हर टाइप का जो भी फोर्सेस है नेचर में वहां न्यूट्रॉन थर्ड ला एप्लीकेबल है नंबर फोर एक्शन एंड रिएक्शन एक्शन एंड रिएक्शन ऑलवेज एक्ट ऑलवेज एक्ट ऑन टू डिफरेंट बॉडीज अभी लिख लो देन वी विल एक्सप्लेन दम ओके वी नीड टू बॉडीज वन सपोज दैट वेन दिस ए ऑब्जेक्ट ए हिट्स बी वी विल से एक्शन नाउ इन टर्न बी एक्सर्ट फोर्स ऑन ए दैट इज कॉल्ड रिएक्शन रिएक्शन बट हेयर यू हैव टू गिव वन थिंग इन माइंड सिंस एक्शन एंड रिएक्शन वी नीड टू बॉडीज डेफिनेटली नाउ दिस इज साइमल्टेनियस दिस इज साइमल्टेनियस एक्शन रिएक्शन आर साइमल्टेनियस वी कैन वी कैन एक्शन वी कैन से दैट चूंकि ये पहले ये करता है उसके बाद नहीं ये एग्जैक्टली उसी टाइम दोनों करते हैं एक इसमें फोर्स डालता है एक इसमें ए बी पे डालता है फोर्स बी ए पे डालता है सो वी कैन एक्शन वी कैन से दिस इज एक्शन रिएक्शन दिस इज एक्शन ओके we can exchange them okay since they are simultaneous they are simultaneous tenis we can say jo maine yahan par reaction likha usko hum action bhi likh sakte hain yes sir jisko action likha usko reaction bhi likh sakte hain because since they are same we cannot we cannot distinguish which exerted force on uh, one another first okay so we can say that action and reaction anybody whether a is a uh, thing is called action or b b jo kar raha hai wo action hai and another reaction clear yes sir so we can exchange it is not koi uh, hard and fast rule ki aap batao ji jab a aaya to tabhi humne action mana nahi you can say anything because the process is simultaneous panchwa jo iska point hai that is aaj saaf dikhai de raha hai Yes, no action can occur in the absence of reaction in the absence of reaction sahi baat hai because it needs two things when there will be action there should be reaction there there cannot be only action okay Yes, sir. Uh, so when there is action, there must be reaction. Number six. So ये मैंने कहा था action and reaction, action and reaction forces, action reaction are all forces. Act simultaneously. नंबर सेवन फोर्स ऑफ एक्शन एंड रिएक्शन एंड रिएक्शन एक्ट एक्ट अलॉन्ग the line joining joining the centers of the two body yani iska matlab hai if 
this is center of A and this is center of B. Then they will act along these this line. This is the line joining the centers. Okay. Yes, sir. When they act, this is center of one. This is center of second. So we will join this by a line. This is a line. So this X goes X along this end, this direction, along the center. Eight, number eight. Newton's third law of motion is applicable whether bodies are rest or in motion. Newton's third law is applicable is applicable whether bodies are at rest or in motion. Or in motion. Okay, this is understandable. Number nine. Go ahead. Number nine. Action and reaction. Action. Okay. Yes, sir. Action and reaction. Are equal and opposite. Equal. Yes, sir. And opposite. So, nine points regarding Newton's third law. Pella, a single isolated force cannot does not exist. So, whenever forces exist, that they always exist in pair. In nature, no single force exists. So, suppose when I push this thing, now I have applied the force. In turn, it will apply force. So they will move, move भी कर सकते हैं रोक भी सकते हैं यहाँ पर move नहीं कर रहे अगर मैं करूँ तो ये suppose this is a body when I push it in turn it is also pushing my hand so single force cannot exist clear जब भी force act करेंगे वो pair में करेंगे Newton's charge third law is applicable for all types of forces in nature जो भी forces हैं electromagnetic है electrostatic है gravitational है हर एक ये न्यूटन थर्ड लॉ अप्लाई करता है। वैन यू जब आप ग्रेविटेशन पढ़ोगे वहाँ प्रूव भी करना है। शो दैट न्यूटन्स लॉ जिस ग्रेविटेशन न्यूटन्स लॉ ऑफ ग्रेविटेशन ओबेस्ट थर्ड लॉ ऑफ मोशन। एक्शन और रिएक्शन ऑलवेज एक्ट ऑन टू डिफरेंट बॉडीज। ठीक? एक्शन और रिएक्शन दो बॉडीज नहीं होगी बात समझ में आई एक्शन रिएक्शन फोर्स और साइमल्टेनियस एक ही साथ में ये साइमल्टेनियस हो रही जब जैसे ही ये आपस में टच करते हैं ये एक एक दूसरे पे उसी टाइम फोर्सेस लगाता है वन विल बी कॉल्ड एक्शन एंड अनदर विल बी कॉल्ड रिएक्शन इट इज अप टू द इट इज अप टू द पर्सन व्हिच व्हिच फोर्स इट ही कॉल्स एक्शन एंड व्हिच ही कॉल्स रिएक्शन बिकॉज़ दे आर साइमल्टेनियस वी कैन नॉट सेपरेट देम Seven force of action reaction act along the line joining the centers. And how to, along which direction? The line joining the centers is direction. So A will act along force uh, exerted by A will act along in this direction, and force act, uh, exerted by B will be, uh, act along this direction. Newton's third law is applicable whether bodies are in natural motion. Action and reaction are equal and opposite. Clear? Now, we have to prove of Newton's third law. Proof of third law of motion. Now, we have to give the proof. Okay. Now, 